So today we want to assemble a two-stroke engine, two-stroke piston. It is an aircraft two-stroke engine. It's used in very light aircraft. Uh, it's, uh, a two-stroke engine is uh, a very good engine, but it's limited in certain aspects. So we have different parts of it. We have the piston. We have the piston, piston pin, or they call it the knuckle pin. We have the connecting rod. We have a crankshaft. So this is how it works. Here we have a magnet tube. We have this magnetic generator. This is the electricity. So we want to assemble all of it back. So the crankshaft is here. Uh, sitting on the crankcase. The crank crankshaft is sitting on the crankcase. The parts of the crankshaft that we can easily recognize are how do you call this? This is the crank chicks. This is the crank pin. This is the main journal on a, a crankshaft. So the difference between a four stroke engine and a two stroke engine is that a four stroke for it to complete one circle it goes round two, two times. Two times. So two times means seven hundred and twenty degrees. But a two stroke in one cycle it makes three sixty degrees. So three sixty means that when the piston goes up it does two events which is integration. When it comes down it will be power as in So today we just want to look at different parts of this engine. So we have uh, the cylinder, cylinder barrel and then cylinder head where the piston is always in, inside the cylinder. Then we have for the piston rings. Now the difference between the piston rings of a two-stroke engine and a, a four-stroke engine is that the rings are pinned. Pin. Pin. So why are they pinned? To avoid snagging. To avoid snagging. Then uh, the other difference is that the oil of the two-stroke engine is mixed in the fuel tank. But in four-stroke engine, the oil system is separate. So we mix the oil in the filter for what reason? To dissipate it. To dissipate it. That is for lubrication and also to help with it. So this is a simple demonstration. So now we're going to assemble everything back. Uh, this engine is cooled by water, majorly cooled by water. So we will assemble everything back at this point. So let's start assembling. spark plugs on top of it we have our propeller and the reduction gearbox well installed back the exhaust is here well installed back and then we have uh, the in inlet side also well installed back 
So we just want to install it back to our aircraft that uses this engine. And then we see if we can take it for a test flight. Ah. We see awesome. if we try and run the engine and see if we've installed it in the right, the right position. Sure. So that is it. Yes. Let's install it back to the aircraft. Yes. Yes. Yes.